Friends, this is a very soft cataract. Let us see how it was managed. This is the main incision, 2.8 millimeter incision on the posterior aspect of the limbus. And now, visco is injected into the anterior chamber and it is spread over the corneal epithelium for better visibility. In this case, only one side port was made on the left side about three clock hours away. And now, the capsule is incised with the 26 case bare needle, a capsular tag is raised. Now I take a uterus horseps, hold this capsular tag, go anti-clockwise all around and make a rexis of adequate size. The rexis is completed. Now hydro dissection. PSS is passed just under the anterior capsular rim. Here it is, goes to the opposite equator. Hydro delineation is also done and it has produced a beautiful golden ring in this case. This is a very soft cataract. Nuclear sclerosis will be grade 1 or 1 plus. And now the tip of the FACO handpiece is introduced. In this case, my plan is to remove the nucleus within few seconds. Just tilt it and emulsify it within few seconds. That's it. The nucleus is managed. Now, this thick cushion of epinucleus. In such cases, removal of epinucleus takes longer time than nucleus because you have to take care of the posterior capsule. You cannot go to far periphery because you can catch the posterior capsule and make a rent. So be very careful. You can come out, inject some visco behind the epinucleus and remove it safely. Yes, the nuclear epinucleus has been managed. Now some visco is injected into the anterior chamber and capsular bag. And now is the time to remove the cortical lens matter. I'm using this 23 gauze Simco to remove the cortex. Very little cortex is remaining and some cells are sticking to the posterior capsule. Yes, it is almost removed. Hydro polish is safer than cap back mode because in cap back mode you can still catch posterior capsule and make a small rent. So cortical cleanup has been done satisfactorily and now hydro implantation. The lens is implanted in the capsular bag. The irrigating proof keeps the AC formed and the irrigating proof places the trailing haptic in the capsular bag, rotates the lens and the case is done. Friends, this is a totally unedited surgery. So if you follow the right technique and if you have a large volume of surgery, you find out ways to do it fast but in a safe manner. The only sideboard that has been made in this case has been closed by stromal hydration. This is the final lavage of the capsular bag as well as the anterior chamber. And now this anterior chamber is formed nicely. The wounds are checked and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills.